Hey guys, this last part is going to be really easy because I took good care to actually connect all the lines. So there's not really going to be any gaps or any kind of problems. All right, so I'm going to run you through the process. It's going to take not too long. I'm going to take the eyedropper tool right here to sample the color of Ralphie's shirt. That gives me that fill. I will then go ahead and make that layer invisible again. I'll click. Whoops. Okay. That bled out somewhere, so I'm going to go over here. Whoops. Get back here, Ralph. I'm going to come over here to this option right here underneath these ink wells. If you haven't figured this out yet, don't close gaps, close small gaps, close medium gaps, close large gaps. I'm going to choose close small gaps. That worked. So I'll get the rest of his shirt. All right. Now I'll go get another color. Let me grab that part of his shirt. I'll select this red and click. I'll click right here, 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 and here. What else? Okay. I'll select the shoes and click here. Whoops. Something's going wrong. Let's go close medium gaps. That worked. I'll select the pants, paint bucket. I'll select the belt. I think that worked. Uh, let's see. I'll go ahead and select this white. Gray. And finally, the skin color. Get this white again. White. And let's swap these colors for the black. And let's go get that color for the glue. Click, click, whoops. I guess I saw that as a gap. Let's get that skin again. And Ralphie's done. Easy. And like I said, it's an easy, I had an easy time. Whoops, I uh, saw this as a gap too. There we go. I had an easy time because I took good care to make nice clean lines. So the cleaner the lines, the easier of a time you're going to have filling it. And that is the tutorial.